Hey guys, in this video, we're going to talk about the importance of cholesterol for your muscles, okay? Now, the brain, the nervous system, and your muscles desperately need cholesterol, okay? Without cholesterol, they just don't work. So the body can make cholesterol, and it makes a lot of it. It makes like 3,000 milligrams every single day, but you also get it from the diet. But the dietary cholesterol only accounts for 20 to 25% of your total cholesterol, okay? So people are freaking out about cholesterol. It's, it's going to cause my heart, you know, to have a heart attack and blah, blah, blah. But that's actually not true. I'm going to put a link down below for some more data that you need to uh, watch on that one point. But in this video, we're not going to cover too much of that. So consuming foods high in cholesterol, consuming dietary cholesterol does not increase your blood cholesterol levels, okay? If you disagree with me, please do the research and put a link down below to show me proof of that. You will not find any study that shows any type of significant increase in your blood cholesterol by consuming cholesterol because there is no study that proves that. And that's interesting. Cholesterol is needed to make bile to help you digest fats. Cholesterol is needed to make vitamin D. But your muscles really need uh, cholesterol to actually make them stronger, to make them bigger, because cholesterol actually is a precursor for making certain sex hormones, okay? They're anabolic. They build things up. So anabolic means build things up. So testosterone, for example, uh, needs cholesterol. So without cholesterol, you can't make testosterone. So when people have high cholesterol, they're usually put on a statin drug, right? Now, the problem with statins is that it blocks the pathway to make cholesterol in the liver. So it shuts down the total production of cholesterol. And look at some of the top side effects. Myopathy, which is a destruction of your muscle cells. It actually kills muscle. Myositis, which is inflammatory conditions of your muscle. Muscle pain, back pain, achy uh, uh, muscles. Uh, weakness in the muscle, low amounts of coenzyme Q10, which your heart needs, your heart muscle needs that to be able to work right. So these are the side effects of low cholesterol or blocking the cholesterol pathways. So this is the connection between cholesterol and muscles. You need it to actually function. Statins even have a black box warning because it causes diabetes, which then increases your risk for heart attack. So here you're taking statins to lower your cholesterol to suppose, supposedly protect your heart, but then the side effect causes heart problems. Insane. So the benefits of statins are very, 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 very insignificant, but the side effect is very, very, very huge. If you want information, alternative ways to support your diet to help stabilize normal cholesterol levels, I put a link down below. But the point is that you don't be afraid of consuming cholesterol if you want to support your muscles and also to support healthy testosterone levels. All right. Thanks for watching. Hey, if you haven't already subscribed, press the button below and I will keep you in the know. Hey, that rhymes.